Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to find a perfect lipstick for your undertone. In this video, I'm not only going to show you perfect red for you, I'm going to include nudes, pinks, and finally reds. Then I'm also going to show you all my lipstick collection. I want to include all my lipsticks, almost, almost all. And I'm going to separate them in reds, pinks, and nudes, so that you can see uh, as well like comparing these colors, which one is going to be good on your skin tone. If you still don't know your undertone, you should pause this video here and go and check out this video, which is on uh, how to find your skin undertone. Then come back here and let's find a perfect lipstick for you. First of all, I'm going to explain you how lipsticks are made, how colors are made. Let me show you this picture. So here we have classic red, and since I made this in Photoshop, I, uh, down is shown like hex color code of this color, so it's FF0000. Adding white, it becomes pink and like pastel color. Adding black, it becomes more brown uh, to the point where it's dark brown. Here you have pink with its hex color code. Adding white, it uh, becomes pastel lilac -y color. And as you can see on the right, adding black, it starts to become more darker and obviously it comes to the point where it's like deep purple shade. If you add blue to classic red, you are eventually going to get more you add, you're going to get like that pink, fuchsia and in the end purple color. More you yellow you add to the red, you are, start, uh, you are starting to get that coral and orange and then in the end bright orange. So finally here, adding uh, white to that uh, exact same red, you are getting, as we saw, pinkish colors. But if you add gray, and gray is a mixture between white and black, so uh, if you add gray to red, you are getting these now popular colors, uh, which are mauvey, dusty, uh, pinkish and brownish colors that can look great on every skin undertone, trust me. So here I have uh, all my red lipsticks. These three are pink undertones, so cool undertone. And then there are two brown uh, tones, uh, darker brown, which is cool undertone, almost coffee color, and the uh, warm brown, which is for warm undertones. And these here are classic reds or in general, warm undertone red. These are my nudes. Uh, I love my nudes. Um, it's mostly cool nudes. These two are warm uh, undertone nudes. Uh, the rest is mostly cool. And these two in particular, so I'm showing you now. Yeah, these two, uh, these two are from NYX, are perfect on cool undertone. This is, these are pink lipsticks uh, and purples, a uh, mixture of warm and cool undertones. This one is more ne neutral of all. So many of you probably already can tell the difference between warm and cool, but it's not that difficult actually. If you are not trained, just try to train your eye. Eventually you will get it. On my lips now, just for information, I have this one and this one mixed together. So in my opinion, this one is perfect for every undertone because this is a classic uh, classic red that looks good on everybody, in my opinion. This is uh, Too Faced Melted Matte in the shade Lady Balls. This one is uh, much more darker and it's more on the warm yellow side and it's from the Balm Meet Matte Hues. It's the shade Adoring. So uh, mixing these two together, I get this shade. I see myself personally mm, as a neutral undertone because I have both of those characteristics uh, that you just saw in that video and um, but I some days some days I just uh, I'm leaning on the warm side because my neck uh, and my arms are pretty yellow uh, comparing to my face even though you shouldn't consider your face at all because of hormones as we said but um, yeah I think I'm neutral undertone leaning to warm undertone Obviously, if you are neutral undertone, you can wear 
almost every lipstick, I mean every color. If you are warm undertone, you should go for those warm undertone lipstick colors. So the ones that have uh, brown and yellow inside. And if you are cool undertone, you can go on those lipsticks for those lipsticks that are pink, that have blue inside and that's like pink and blue tint. One more thing I have to say, I really believe that uh, makeup has no rules and that makeup is for everybody and that every color looks good on everybody. I wanted to make this video for everybody who uh, want to know like what just what will look good on, on them, what will accentuate your face, what will make you look younger and healthier and all that good stuff. But uh, in the base of the things, I really believe that you can wear whatever color you like. I personally wear blue, green, black even, and it doesn't matter. If you are a more <laughs> classic person uh, and you like more like a classic makeup, then this video, I hope, I hope it's going to be useful. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you find this video helpful, click like on this video and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to click also that little bell button next to the subscribe button to get notifications when I upload. And I'm going to see you in my next video. Bye!